Good morning from the UK. How you all doing? So today we'll be doing an interesting vlog and we'll be going over to Birmingham. Birmingham is the bigger city compared to where I live and I'll be visiting an Afro-Caribbean shop called Monique's Kitchen where you get the opportunity to go around and see everything she's got in her Afro-Caribbean shop. This video will be beneficial for all Afro-Caribbeans, all Africans or anyone who's interested in trying out African food. You don't want to miss out on this and I have something special at the end of the video so make sure to watch from beginning to end. Monique says she's got something special for me so we'll be doing some food tasting towards the end of the video. You don't want to miss out so join me and let's ride. Come on with me. So before I moved in from London to the West Midlands, I was so concerned about whether I was going to get African food to buy. So as you all can see, there's so much you can get from here. You're not going to miss London if you're making a choice or you're making a decision to move in from London to the West Midlands. Cost of living here is very low. So please do not worry about having African food when you move in to the West Midlands. There is everything you need here. You're not going to miss anything except of course the excessive noise in London. <laughs> So yeah, she's got everything, there's plantain, papo, onions, ginger, everything, yeah?
from Birmingham and today we visited Monique's kitchen in Birmingham and I'm just gonna show you guys a few things that I got from Monique's kitchen the good thing about her shop is not just a supermarket she's got already made food that you can just grab on the go like that is what fascinates me so much about her I just love Monique's um, tenacity and her hard work and the way she goes all out to make her customers happy I just love that about her this this video is not sponsored I'm just doing this because I want to support black owned businesses um, within the West Midlands so I chose her because I've been following her for a while and I really really love the way she markets her stuff so today we're gonna have a look at what I was able to grab so the first thing that I grabbed is this pack of fish and um, her food is you know mainly affordable it's just five pound a pack so you can just grab go if you don't feel like cooking you can just grab these put them in the fridge and then microwave them and you're good to go so stick around I'm going to do a testing um, of one of the foods once I'm done showing you guys all the stuff that I got so the first thing I got is this um, pack of fish She's got um, shrimps in there and then this dried fish. You can have this with banku, you can have this with kenke, with anything. It's really, really, really very well packaged. I love it. It looks good already. I can't wait to have a bite. Um, another one that I love so much is this jollof rice. Yeah, when you look at the packaging, she's got um some spaghetti on there gari egg and then you have a choice to choose whether you want fish or you want chicken and the size of the pack is really good unlike you know other smaller packs this pack is really good and it's really good value for money um yeah very nice and then another thing i grabbed was um fried rice with shito and chicken and then it's got coleslaw on the side you can always keep these fresh in the fridge for about three days and then eat them how i really wish i found monique when i was pregnant like i needed this in my life like i'm just literally finding her but anyways um she just got herself a permanent customer because it's not always that i feel like cooking so when that time comes, I don't feel like cooking. I just have to move my car 20 minutes drive to Birmingham and then I grab myself some bites. So the next thing I got is jollof rice. Also comes with salad and the shito. And then you have a choice of either chicken or fish, okay? Um, really good size as well. I, I really love Monique's packaging. Kudos says really nice, really, really, really nice. And then um, I got this Fanti Kenke straight from Ghana. 
So what I'll be doing with this, I'll be doing, we call it mashke, yeah? I'll be doing ice cream cake with these. And I was able to grab about four of them, yeah? So here they are as well. And then, I got this bottle of shito. Also really nice. It's five pound a bottle. Um, I'm not quite sure the price of this one, but they've got different sizes. So this is the bottle and what it, it says is Obapa Tasty Shito. Obedia Tafri Wonsa. Yeah, so this is it. This is it. And in the, the ingredients of this shito, we've got ginger, pepper, salt, tomatoes, shrimps, onion, and powdered fish. Okay? So just the ingredients to just let you know that it's going to taste really good. Okay? And then last but not least, which I'll be tasting live for you guys to see how it goes I'm going to give you my honest honest opinion about the taste of this because this is my favorite so far this is Diehu or the, the houses will call it Tuozafi I don't know what it's called in other languages but the Akans call it Diehu those from the north call it Tuozafi and it's a very very enjoyable delicacy from Ghana I love it so this is the swallow and this is the ayoyo soup with a stew and some goat meat so these are the things I grabbed from Monique thank you so much sis and I'm going to do a taste in the moment I'm just going to put the, um, put the dehu in the microwave warm it up and then I'll taste on camera for you guys and tell you my honest opinion. Stay tuned, don't go anywhere. Okay guys, so now that we finished with talking about the stuff, now that we're done doing the talking, it's time for the tasting, like testing of a mini. Okay, so besides having a shop, Monique also does catering services. She can cater for your engagements, weddings, birthdays, whatever it is. I'm going to link her number in the description so you can call her if you're within the West Midlands. She covers the Wolverhampton, Birmingham, Telford, Dudley, Warsaw, this whole area, Coventry, anywhere in the West Midlands, she can cater for your programs, okay? So now we are coming to do the tasting the testing of the Tuozafi alias Diehu okay okay so hmm this is good guys you need to taste this like it has the authentic taste of Ghana Diehu really nice hmm Stamonique nice one nice one nice one nice one hmm okay good one now you guys know I need to sit down. Wait, let me drink some. Mm. I need to do the rest of the tasting off camera, all right, guys? Let me sit down so that this food can go to the right corners, you know? Can go to the right chambers. <laughs> I'm going to do the rest of the tasting of camera. Yeah. All right, guys. So this brings us to the end of this vlog. I'm sorry, I'm talking to you with food in my mouth. Like, I'm tasting, right? <laughs> Thank you all for joining me. If you've watched this video up to this point and you haven't subscribed, please. Subscription is free. You don't pay a penny. You don't pay a dime. Just click on the red subscription button on my channel. Turn on post notifications so that each time I upload a video, you will have a notification and you'll be the first to know. 
I'll be doing giveaways at random for people to comment first. So please turn on post notifications because if you subscribe and you don't have the post notification on, you will not know when I come on live. So please subscribe if you haven't. To my returning subscribers, thank you so much for supporting Sunday Sunday to this point. And until we meet again is bye from me. Bye.